What is up my trainer nation? It's your boy the Bearded Trainer coming at you with another episode of Pokemon Go. How is everybody doing today? It's great to see you guys. Uh, I hope you guys missed me as much as I missed you. If you did, leave a let, let me down in the comments below. Uh, it is May 24th, CDOT Community Day. Uh, today we are over at Sims Park and we're going to try to get us some shiny CDOT. Uh, hopefully we'll be productive. But anywho, if you're new to the channel, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button. If you like the content, go ahead and leave a like on the video. And if you have something to say, whether it be positive or negative, let me know down in the comments below. Uh, let me know if you don't like the content and why. If you do like the content, let me know. Uh, but as I said before, we're over here at CDOT Community Day at Sims Park. It is almost that time. And uh, let's talk a little bit about CDOT Community Day. So CDOT Community Day, your buddy's gonna bring you more helpful items. There's a special one-time purchase uh, May community box for that has one Elite Fast TM, 30 Ultra Balls, three Incense, and three Lucky Eggs. So that's beneficial just for that Elite TM uh, alone. Uh, we've got three times Catch XP and three hour Incense today. Uh, there is an optional uh, research that you can do called Seeing Double. Uh, that's available for a dollar in the United States uh, or the equivalent to whatever uh, wherever you're from and then you have uh, snapshot surprises today so take a look at the um, the graphic I have up on the screen and uh, we're gonna go ahead and get into this today I'm really excited to be back guys all right so we've got about two minutes until community day officially starts we're gonna go ahead and get that up on the screen here in a minute and we're gonna go ahead and watch those first spawns change all right, ladies and gentlemen, it is 10.59, and we should be seeing those spawns change any second now. So, let's take a look, couple of shiny checks. Is this a shiny? No, I still haven't gotten my shiny ponytail. Uh, shiny Magnemite? No. I think we're good on uh, shiny Piplup. We had plenty of those during that community day. It was a lot of fun, though. Uh, and I clicked on the Magnemite again. But hey, we are coming, we are approaching that 11 o'clock hour. Right, I'm excited. Let's see the spawns change. Here we go. It's 11 o'clock. Bam! All right, let's get our first C dot checks in, and we also have Professor Willow down here in the bottom right-hand corner uh, to illustrate that new research that we got. So, first C dot check. Are we shiny? No, we are not. Second shiny. Nope. Let me go back and check that one. Was that shiny? No, it wasn't shiny. All right. Do we get the third and fourths? Nope, still not getting another one. Come on, come on now. No shinies on the first couple of checks. That's okay though. And we got a Lyron just randomly spawning over here. But let's go ahead and get into this. Let's take a look at the research and see what it has to offer. Oh, I better get that. Uh, all right, hey there, Beta Trainer. You surprised me, much like CDOT. Just fell from that tree over there. I really scared a Pidgey that I was foraging nearby, and I'm pretty sure it did uh, did that on purpose. It's easy for CDOT to trick people and Pokemon alike because the CDOT are almost indistinguishable from acorns. As they're appearing in higher numbers right now, I am seeing, am I seeing, or am I seeing double? Could you help me investigate this nutty situation? And there we go. So let's take a look at the first power for Pokemon 10 times, catch 15 CDOT, and make five nice throws. So let's go ahead and get ourselves ready. I, I have not even taken into that special community day box. Man, they really priced that up just for the uh, for the uh, Elite Fast TM. So let's go ahead and knock that out. Boom. All right, we are good to go. Let's get grinding. Ladies and gentlemen, we haven't even been into the event eight minutes and check it out. Here we go. Our first shiny C dot. Let's go. That's what's up. All right. Let's see. He has a whopping 87 CP. So we're going to go ahead and knock him out and see if he's any good, man. That's awesome. That's the first time I think I've gotten a shiny that fast on Community Day. I remember on Piplup Community Day, it took me like an hour before I started getting any. Then they started coming in. But there we go. We locked down the first, first 15 checks. Let's see this guy. All right, let's go take take a look at the IVs on that uh, C dot. I'm excited. That's what's up. We're one third of the way to our goal. There he is, whopping 87 CP. Is he any good? Not at all, but that's okay. So <laughs> let's go ahead and try to uh, get some more. See you in a bit. 
All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are back. We've completed the first couple of challenges in regards to the uh, the research. Let's go ahead and get that up on screen now. All right, so it's power up a Pokemon 15 times, catch 15 C dot, and make great three great throws. We're gonna take a look and see what that offers. I see 20 awesome C dot candy. Let's see, we got 10 Pokeballs, and let's see what the mystery Pokemon is. It's a C dot. Go figure. All right, let's catch him real quick. Let's get this done, man. If I take away with just three today, I'm completely content with that, but let's go ahead and take a look at the next step of the research. We got another reward, 200 dust, uh, incense, and a wild Pokemon appears. I'm assuming it might be another C-Dot. So, let's see. Oh, look at that. And it's not shiny. Go figure. The old man says, Welcome back, Bearded Trainer. While you're away, I just was refreshing my memory on C-Dot. Apparently, it attaches itself to a tree branch using the top of its head and sucks moisture from the tree it's hanging on from. The more water C-Dot drinks, the glossier its body becomes. Thanks, C-Dot, for, for, from our, for, for reminding us to stay hydrated. Did you know that C-Dot can evolve? Ah, sorry, I just startled by another one. Why don't you try evolving a C-Dot? Maybe it'll get calmer and stop playing pranks on everyone. All right, so there we go, that's a given. Evolve three C-Dot, transfer 10 Pokemon, and catch another 15 C-Dot. So we're gonna go ahead and keep hunting, try to knock these objectives out, and we'll be back. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we officially got our second. Check it out on the screen right now. We got our second shiny of the day. It is 11:30, so that's about 10 minutes, uh, 15 minutes apart from the previous one. Let's go ahead and knock this one down. We almost have our shiny family complete. Let's hope he doesn't run. I might have needed to use a raspberry on that. There we go. Shiny number two in the books. We also started uh, finishing, well, started. We started to finish up the second sec part of the research. As you saw before, we didn't get any shinies in that research. Uh, oh, we did some throwback challenge. Well, that's for another video. Uh, where is it? Where is it? Okay, here we go. It's a throwback challenge. Where's the C dot research? Okay, it's over here. All right, so we still need to transfer 10, which will be easy enough, and evolve three. And we'll be back when we get to that. Ladies and gentlemen, not more than 15 seconds after the last clip, we got ourselves our third shiny C dot. Let's go! All right, man, this is turning out to be a pretty good. We're already three within 30 minutes. That's great. And let's lock him down, man. I'm excited. Oh, he bounced it back, but we got shiny pseudo wudo for the save. Let's go. One, two, three. That's what we're talking about right there. Ladies and gentlemen, check it out. We are on number four. Now, here's the thing. I actually just had another one, but unfortunately, I ran from it to try to give you guys a cool little sparkle show. Unfortunately, I lost it. It was on an incense, and they're going every 30 seconds or so. Let's get it. All right. That's what's, um, that's, that, that's what's up, man. That's what I'm talking about right there. That's good stuff. We got to finish up this... Uh, nope, no back-to-back. -back. We got to finish up this research. Can we go? Nope. Not another one. Oh, another one popped up at my feet. No. I love it. Check it out. One, two, three. Boom. Number five. Already in the bag. Man, this is becoming a great community day already. Let's. We're going to take a look and see how many I've acquired so far. I think I'm at six. It could be seven. could be five. could be wrong. Let's take a look. Let's go ahead and take a look at this guy. Is he any good? Oh, the sounds of the city are alive. Not very good at all. Let's try that again. All right, one, two, three. Okay, I guess it is only five. All right, we'll be back when we get six. Ladies and gentlemen, we are back. And so if you take a go ahead and take a look at the screen real quick, we've got ourselves shiny C dot number six. I haven't checked any of these in a while, so let's go ahead and take a look and see if he's any good. I don't know. Oh, let's go. Look at that. That's probably the best one I've seen out here. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we're taking a little intermission. We're gonna go pick up the little trainer from home and bring her out to the park. And if you look right here on the screen, we've got ourselves shiny number 10. We're doing pretty good so far. Let's go ahead and take a look at, uh, well, we got a cluster here. Let's see if we got any more. No, uh, are you shiny? No, no, maybe that guy? No, are you shiny? No, no. All right, so none of this cluster. We're gonna catch these. We're gonna go pick up my little girl. 
All right, ladies and gentlemen, we uh, got back over here to the park. We happened to jump in on a timber raid. Say hi. Hi, look at I got. She's got a medal. But we decided to jump in on a timber raid real quick. We're here at the screen. Uh, we're gonna do our shiny check here. Let's uh, let's see if we get the shiny timber. Three, two, one, let's go. No, I still cannot get this shiny. All right, so we're gonna get back over to the main park. We're gonna have some lunch, and then we're gonna get back to hunting. We'll see you in a bit. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are back. We got this massive cluster. We are finally back over here at Sims Park. So now we've got to transfer 10 Pokemon and evolve a Nuzly. All right, we'll go ahead and evolve this guy. Wow, we're already at 946 candy. So we're gonna evolve him, and then we're gonna transfer 10. I gotta move back a little bit, because this is, uh, this is a little bit strenuous. So we've evolved our Nuzleaf into a shift tree. Now we've got all of those completed. So, wow, it looks like that nest has tripled. Um, so let's take a look. And this is step three of step four. And we get a rocket radar, an incense, and some dust. So let's go. All right. So, your Nuzleaf has evolved into Shiftree, the wicked Pokemon. Unfortunately, upon reviewing data on Shiftree, I learned it can be quite fearsome too. Using its leafy fan, Shiftree can create wind gusts with speeds of up to 100 feet per second. Alright, that's a cool Pokedex entry. That's strong enough to level houses. I think I need to go tie my mobile lab down. I'd rather be surprised by a CDOT than blown away by a Shiftree. Ha! Lesson learned. Stay up to date with Pokemon, even familiar ones. Thank you for your help researching this odd occurrence. Once these winds die down, I'll be in touch for our next research adventure. Does this complete the, the task? Okay, so it looks like that completes the research. All right, so we got some stuff here and now it looks like we got a wild encounter. Dust, three candies, and a wild Pokemon appears. She's having so much fun. <laughs> All right, so let's take a look at what this wild spawn is. Here we go, it's a shift tree. Now, I don't know, let me know down in the comments below, did you get the shiny after completing the research? I don't know if you can, but 968, all right, that's not a great throw. All right, so he goes down, let's take a look at him. Not great at all. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are officially in the last Eight minutes of the event. We got this little cluster here. I'm gonna see if we got any last minute shiny luck. We've got about 18 now. I wanna see if there's anything good gonna pop off of this. No. But the lone little guy over here. Is he shiny? Come on. Yay! We got it! We got it! We got it! We got it! Let's go! All right. I guess that's gonna be my last bit of shiny luck. Uh, shiny magic right there. I've already picked out some. Oh, no, 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 no. Don't you run. Don't you run. Oh, we're gonna get this guy. All right, so we, this, this is gonna probably be the last catch of the event. Man, six hours is just too long to do shiny hunting. I'm tired, she's tired, and uh, we've already picked out some for uh, evolutions for, for some Ultra League and some Great League, but I think we've had a very eventful day. Let's go ahead and take a quick look. That's awesome, we got a last minute shiny, let's go! Bam. All right, there we go. Let's see. We got 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, 16, 7. We got a total of 18 shinies today. Let me know how many shinies you got down in the comments below. If you guys enjoyed this video, please go ahead and smash that like button. Uh, if you guys want to see when I post, uh, get notified whenever I post new content, go ahead and hit the little notification bell up in the top corner up here somewhere. That always confuses me. Uh, but thank you for joining me for today's community day. I hope you guys did well, and I'll see you in the next one. Later.